Sal and Georgie are gone. And after all the shit we've been through, we run this city. So we finally gonna get our chance to make things right in this town. Bring a balance to things. Wasn't certain we'd ever actually get here. No, that's the kind of news you never get tired of hearing. After all the bullshit, it's almost impossible for me to wrap my brain around the fact that we actually did it. You're a fucking saint, Lincoln. And I'm honored to know you. We're not here because of what I did, or because of what any of y'all did. We're here because we stood together. And as long as we stay strong, ain't no one ever gonna fuck with us. After he killed Selma, Connell Lincoln Clay took over. But he wasn't content just to run the city. He expanded out across the South into Florida and even the Carolinas. There's so much money coming in, and he's been smart with it. He spreads it around, makes sure the right people get paid and stay paid. The city's favorite son, hmm? Yeah. Rebuilding the hollow. Buying up Frisco Field, reopening the theme park, all that money and goodwill. He thinks it's made him untouchable, but no one is untouchable. He might have plastered his name across a few schools and hospitals, uh, made donations to a charity here and there, but nothing absolves him of his crimes. That's why I agreed to do this documentary. I want to shine a light on the real Lincoln Clay. Lincoln gave in to everything. Drugs, booze, prostitutes, you name it. If he made a dollar, he was involved. Seeing him on the news, strutting around. Sometimes I, I think he should have died over at Sammy's with all the rest of them. There'd be uh, kind of a peace in that. Any of this? 